Hello, Melody Festival Club. My name is Martina Barta and I will represent my country, Czech Republic, at the Eurovision Song Contest 2017 in Kiev. And I'm super excited and I hope you will like that. Bellucci di Praga, capolavoro, Martina, 12 points from Italy, definitely, c'è, c'è il Republic Karma, bella about yourself Martina, you come from the Czech Republic, what, I mean, you are a singer, you are a performer, tell about yourself, what are you doing in the Czech Republic? Uh, I was born in Czech Republic and uh, I also studied in German, so I've been living in Germany. So I'm still traveling between Berlin and Prague. And uh, yeah, I'm a professional singer. I graduated now with the music study and I love music. Uh, I was uh, contacted by the Czech television and uh, I was uh, then later I was chosen and I'm really very honored and I'm really very glad that I had the opportunity to represent my country uh, at the Eurovision Song Contest. It's for me a really big thing. So this happened quite unexpected for you? Uh, yeah, it was really unexpected. Yeah, mm. I didn't, yeah. So why did it show you, you think? Um, I was nominated and then uh, uh, from, from the group of the Czech singers and yeah, there are just internal nominations and uh, there is a special jury that uh, choose the artist and uh, yeah, and then I was just uh, nominated and then contacted and yeah, I'm really very glad. <laughs> so I understand you tour quite a lot between Prague and uh, Berlin, yeah. right? With jazz music, yeah? Yeah, uh, Berlin is my second home time because I studied. Uh, actually, I've been living in Berlin for six years and I'm still traveling between Berlin and Prague, but it's not so far and like, I like that, I like that. I'm all about that bass, about that bass. Yeah, it's pretty clear. Maybe I am size too, but I can shake it, shake it. career you think it will be good to be in Eurovision? Uh, I think it's f for for each musician it's a big opportunity to uh, to show your work and just present yourself uh, uh, f in front of uh, such a huge audience. I think it's really very big big challenge. Yeah. Can you tell me a little bit about your uh, music uh, otherwise except Eurovision? I mean, uh, you quite a lot with uh, jazz music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I, really yeah. I really love jazz music because I also studied jazz uh, uh, in Berlin and that's the music that I brought with because my, my father was a huge uh, jazz uh, mu musician fan. Also, my sister is a jazz musician, so we are cooperating and play playing together. I also perform with Radio Big Band in Czech Republic, and uh, but I also played in the musical theater in Prague and you know I really love music I also study classical music and there are only two kinds of music the bad one and the good one that's what you uh, Duke Ellington said and I also listen to another music so for me it's like music is joining people and I love it I'm really super happy when I can stage on the uh, stand on the stage and just spread the happiness or just all those emotions and feeling that yeah I love that I love that I'm, I'm the uh, happiest creature on the world when I had this opportunity 
uh, Czech Republic doesn't have that big history in the Eurovision, but uh, I feel maybe you know a little bit about Eurovision, have some favorite yes. entries or something? Uh, this year uh, we are with the Czech Republic for the sixth time, mm. uh, the Eurovision Song Contest. People from Germany told me that in 1968, Karl Gott, who is the most famous Czech singer, uh, sang for Austria yes, with true. with the with the song uh, composed by Udo Jürgens. So mm -hmm. I was really excited. Oh my God, I didn't know about that. Yeah, it's a pity that uh, Czech people uh, doesn't um, take this contest so seriously, and I'm I'm really excited by all this. Uh, positive comments and all those uh, energy that is uh, from another countries I really like that and for me it's also like a uh, for me it's important to show through this representation uh, in Kiev the Czech audience hey it's really very nice event it's really one of the biggest music festivals and uh, it's really very nice uh, joining countries and uh, yeah showing the best from the each country I, I like uh, that's my wish. <laughs> so how do you prepare for the revision? You are touring now and uh, uh, what else? Yeah, yeah, we are uh, getting ready for the next stations, for the pre-events. I'm really super excited about that. And uh, we are also working on the stage presentation. I'm also working with my vocal coach in Prague. I'm also having an another concert. So it's like a, now we are on the wave, on the flow to Kiev. And it's like, duh, 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 duh. no free time, no free time. Just working on that and thinking about the song, about the presentation. It's like, a yeah. Uh, long process, but yeah. it's, it's it uh, makes fun. Full time work. Yeah, full time work. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I see. And uh, what can you say about your entry? I mean, uh, what is the message with it? Um, the song that I I will sing, my turn. It's it has got for me a uh, deeper meaning. It's about it's about humanity. It's about uh, not being too egoistic and too selfish. Look around yourself. Be ready to help each other. Uh, it, it could be my turn, your turn. And uh, it doesn't matter if you will help, uh, you should be ready to help everyone, everyone. It doesn't matter if you know him person, personally, if he is young, old, uh, black, white, yellow, green, I don't know what. Uh, and that's what I miss in this time. Uh, I don't like if people, this non-communication, when you go by bus and all those people are playing with the handy, with the cell phone, and there isn't eye contact. And that's what I like, what I miss in this world. Okay. So we hope that message will be well received in Kiev. <laughs> And uh, thank you for this interview. Really thank nice to much. meet you. Baby.